Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel I can't. What's up, beautiful bees? It's me, Shelly Sayal, and I know, I know, I know, I have been missing in action, you guys, but that's why I'm here to update you guys, okay, on um everything, basically, just updating you guys on everything okay so first things first um cj has been sick um my true supporters y'all know that when it comes to my son i stop everything um i stop everything to make sure he's good to make sure he um everything with him is everything um along with him being sick um we had a consultation and um, I'm not gonna speak too much on that right now because I will break my silence on that situation very soon. But that's for another video. Um, next thing is, um, yeah, just about him being sick, basically. Um, he woke up with his eyes crusted and stuff, so we found out he basically has seasonal allergies or whatever. It's never been like that, never been, uh, his eyes have never been crusted over or anything. That was the first thing. And so when it came to um, that, you know, he also caught a cold from um, school and um, his fever kept going up and down. And um, when my son doesn't want to eat, especially pizza, I know something's wrong. So um, I had to take a step back from my platform for a while, uh, for a week. I think it's been, it's been about a week or so. But I've, I've been trying to stay um, up to date with, you know, you guys. I've been trying to make sure I still watch videos, make sure I still give my full support uh, via my television. Um, yeah, because like, you know, when you actually watch a video and you engage with it, uh, that means that you're, you know, that means that if my attention is on my phone, you know, I can't like really be as attentive as I could be if it were on my TV and my phone is down or whatever but most of the time when his dad was at work he had my phone so yeah and if you know me you know me personally you know that my son um thinks my phone is his so uh yeah i was just trying to make him comfortable make sure that um he was just taken care of and he's always and will always forever be my number one priority so yeah i hope you guys understand that and i hope you guys um still show me love you know what i'm saying uh because like i said uh when it comes to him all bets are off and i have to tune in and focus on being the best mother i can be for him period okay next thing is next y'all i've been trying to prepare for vlogmas and the closer i get to it the more i um uh, realize like you know maybe i'm not ready maybe you know i should just shoot for next year um yeah and i don't know it's just like now has just been especially since my channel has been growing um and it's been growing very well so you guys i have y'all to thank for that because y'all not only support me but you stick around and you watch me almost every upload some of you guys watch every upload comment on every post and i genuinely genuinely appreciate and love that but it's just like when you deal with depression and anxiety i don't want to say that i have that i've i've at one point in time, I was diagnosed with um, depression and anxiety. Uh, but through like meditation and, um, you know, learning therapies and stuff like that, um, I don't want to claim that. But, uh, you know, sometimes negative energy and stuff pokes his head, especially when it's those times that you have to be the most grateful for. It seems like that's when the most stuff is thrown at you. And not only was my son sick, but our motor went out on the truck. So, you know, that's another huge, you know, thing, uh, another stressor. Um, it's just life, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to get discouraged. I don't want to allow my YouTube to take a back seat like I have let it do um, in the past. Like, uh, I started my YouTube, I think like four years ago. 
I did like one or two videos and went ghost for like a year and a half. Came back, did like three videos, went ghost. And then now I came back, uh, I think it was May of 2020. And I've been consistent all the way up until then, but I never wanted to, I never want my channel to have to go through, or I never want to put you guys through a silent moment like that again. Um, so I'm just really working on trying to balance things, trying to purge things. Shout out to Push Lady T. I appreciate you. You keep me inspired when I don't want to be. <laughs> I, that's about the easiest way I can say, you know, when you go through certain things, it's like, it's hard to, um, it'd be hard to motivate yourself, but I appreciate you. And, um, I appreciate your, I appreciate your light. Um, Charlene Hill, you as well. But yeah, guys, that's really all. I just, uh, wanted to check in for a while. This is not a long video or anything like that. Not at all. But as you can see, I'm at the park. I, um, not too long ago, worked out and stuff. Been trying to get my body, mind right. Uh, been also trying to get my eating habits together. Been trying to figure out if I want to go straight no meat again. Um, and yeah, but I did feel my best when I did let meat go. Um, but I don't know. I guess I'm still trying to feel myself out and find my true lane. You know, I know that I don't fit in every lane and that's okay, you know, but uh, just trying to continue to find my niche. And it's hard when you can do a lot of things, you know what I'm saying? It's hard to pinpoint or zero in on something that you really enjoy or really like when you really like a lot of things. <laughs> so, you know, that's why my channel is just, you know what I'm saying, all over the place. Oh, I have an update on my um, plants. I'll probably be doing that or trying to do it tomorrow. Um, CJ is feeling better, so I'm trying to get back into the swing of things, y'all. Y'all see my hair. I love my hair. It was literally the best hair decision I've ever made in my life. You know, to wake up and not have to worry about your hair especially when you have like so many other stressors and so many other worries your hair literally becomes the last thing on your mind and so yeah so anyway y'all um my supporter shout out goes to none other than live and love show um i hope i said your name right because but I remembered that I wanted to shout you out because like, girl, you've been giving me laughs. Like the uh, crochet underwear and <laughs> I'm not even gonna get started y'all, but y'all go check her out. She's a, a new YouTuber and she's dope. Her and her son are very funny and uh, yeah. So y'all check out her channel, check her out. And as always, let her know that Shalisa's journal sent y'all. Y'all son is going down. So, I'm about to go ahead and um, end this video. Like I said, this was just merely a check-in, a quick little check-in. So just check in on y'all and um, see how y'all was doing or whatever. So yeah, as always, tell someone that you love them. I love you guys. And give them, shout out to Alabama. <laughs> and give them a big hug. And yeah, stay tuned for the next video bye y'all baby you don't know what you do to me between me and you i feel a chemistry i won't let no one